I have great news. I'm going back to work next week. I know, that's crazy. Who would be excited about working? But I do enjoy my job a lot. There's a lot of excitement in the whole process of it and being part of an essential employee. But the best part is, is that I'm getting back into the swing of things and just, it's glad, I'm so glad to be about to cross the finish line in terms of this whole healing process after having a vitrectomy on my right eye. Today is day 28 and yes, Nadine is feeling a lot better than yesterday. I know and the best part about it is um, I believe that art heals. And you know, when you have certain beliefs about things and you share it with other people, uh, it's a great thing, you know. Sometimes we need to like listen to our own advice upon which I did. And so I pulled out some paint, some watercolor paints, and I began to just paint like a child, like my inner child, Nadine, little Nadine, was painting last night and without judgment, which I think is the best way to, you know, um, to heal yourself in whatever it is, to energize yourself. And so I actually have it, I posted it on stories, but here it is. And I don't know what it is, but I was feeling this. And, you know, I just picked the colors that I thought would work well. And mind you, um, watercolor is a new medium for me. So getting the gist of how to work those colors wet. So the paper was wet, everything was wet. Um, I think the last time I painted something, I painted um, watercolor on dry paper, which I was probably a little more comfortable with. So to do this, I would, it allowed me to be able to play with the colors a little bit more or get a feel of how they were moving about. Um, it is unfinished, I believe. I'm thinking about doodling, but I don't know what I'm going to doodle on to that. So I may work on that today or tomorrow. I'm finding that I, I've always wanted to paint more. And when... I had this situation where I was having, I had this surgery on my eye. It made me think about the fact of how I was looking at life and the things that I put off doing and that maybe I shouldn't put those things off. I, you know, I have a list of the priority of things that I want to do, you know, in terms of job, position, um, other things I want to learn in terms of technology, in terms of creativity, what things I want to be involved in, um, and how I want to uh, inspire, energize other people out there to, to follow their passions. And I needed to remind myself or the situation reminded myself about those things that I was putting off. And I understand there's only so many hours in a day, but I needed to make that part of it. And it is, for me, creating is healing. And I can pick up different things and create, but painting is also a very important thing that I want to continue to do as long as I can do it. And anyone can create art, and that's the thing. So I just wanted to share that with you. Um, later on this week, I will be working on the healing art for the world during this unrest. But this one, um, I believe it's just, you know, me dipping my toes in it. So at this time, I just wanted to thank you for tuning into day 28 of my vitrectomy. Um, and I hope you will tune in tomorrow. Thank you for being a part of my journey. And I want to wish you love, light, and most of all, joy.